Hi everyone, and welcome back. My name is Pandora, and welcome back to Dear Mona, Chapter 28, Braxton Hicks. Another month passed, and the relationship with Sean had gotten better. But my relationship with Mark was still the same. I had to set up the crib in our extra bedroom. Temporary, of course, as st I still planned to move out. The baby was well and truly on its way. However, I wasn't too worried about that, about any of that at the moment. I can't believe you dragged me out here. I'm seven and a half months pregnant. I had no idea it would be so far. But besides, you said you needed the exercise. Yes, a walk around the block, perhaps. We've been searching these woods for Ralph for almost two hours. Are you sure he's here? Positive. It's his normal camping trip. Annual camping trip. He wouldn't be able to escape me in these woods. It's the perfect time to apologize. It's a... Can't argue with your logic there. Looks like you'll have him exactly where you want him. <laughs> That's the plan. But clearly, we're a bit lost. Why don't we try... I don't know. Mm -hmm. Right. The bushes seem to thin out that way. Sounds good. Did you hear that? Hear what? Oh my god! It's a raccoon! Run! Ah! <laughs> if the baby gets rabies, I will kill you. This way seems right. It does. Because there's Ralph right there. Blair? Pandora? What are you guys doing here? I came here to get you back. I think about you non-stop, and I don't care who knows it. Please tell me you'll forgive me. Please tell me you'll give me another chance. Yes, please give her another chance. My ankles are begging you. Wow. Blair, I don't know what to say. No one's ever done anything like this for me before. Do you forgive me? Of course I do. I missed you so much. Yay. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Pandora? Is everything okay? Oh, my God, it hurts. What's wrong? I, I think I'm going in labor. Okay, let's stay calm. Ralph, can you lead us back to the car? Um, don't tell me you don't know where we are. The whole point of this trip is to get lost in the forest. That's why I was so surprised you guys found me. Oh god, I can't deliver my baby out here. Call Sean. These woods are right by his shop. He may be uh, able to help. I think there's we're by Deer Crossing if that helps. Okay, okay, good call. Hello, Sean, I need your help. It's an emergency. Sean's busy. What do you want? Ugh, Stacy. Great, this is the last thing I need. Did you just say an emergency? Yeah. I'm lost in stamp Stamps in the Woods about to deliver the baby. But I doubt you care. Holy crap, we're in Stanford Woods. By Deer Crossing. I know exactly where that is. I can help you. Should I let Stacy help? Yes, she's your only help. Okay. Deer Crossing is right by Wolf's Lodge. Do you see a bunch of o old oaks? Yes. Go through those. I'll be waiting on the other side with my car. Okay, see you soon. Let's hope she's not pranking me. This way. Braxton Hicks. False labor. Your baby's gonna be fine, Pandora. Are you sure? Positive. Although, I don't recommend going back into the woods. Yes, what on earth were you thinking? A three-mile hike? 
Um, it's a long story. Well, you better be careful, young lady. I'm going to tell Blair the news. She's hyperventilating in the waiting room. What I'm wondering is, how did you, my son get wrapped up in the, all this? Um, don't worry. I'll ask him myself. Will you be okay here for a couple minutes? Yes, I'll be fine. Good. Just keep sipping that water. Pandora. I'm so sorry, Mr. Call. Is the baby coming? Sean, what are you... No, the baby isn't coming. It was a false alarm. Oh, thank God. What were you doing in the woods? Long story. It's okay, Sean. The baby's fine. I was busy when you called me, but I just talked to Stacy. She's really worried. Yeah, sure she is. I'm serious. She wanted me to tell you she's sorry. I think this whole thing really scared her. Well, I appreciate her help today, but I'm not ready to forgive her. Understandable. Now, how about I take you for some ice cream? That sounds heavenly. Everything seems so much better with a full with a belly full of ice cream. Mark, what are your mom let me in? Blair called me. Pandora, please tell me you're okay. I I'm fine. I'm sorry she called you. It was just a case of Braxton Hicks. Mark, I promise, I'm... You didn't call me? I thought you heard what happened from your best friend. There was nothing to call you about. Everything was fine. You didn't call me because for the past few months I made you feel like you couldn't. I've been cold to you. Mark, it's okay. Things between you and me are complicated. I'm tired of it being complicated, and I'm sorry I pushed you away. I just couldn't take you not wanting me, not wanting a life with me. It wasn't easy to forgive everything, but I've forgiven my mother, and I think it's time for to forgive you too. Thank God. Listen, I want to talk, but, but I really have to pee. I'll be right back. Oh, his phone is bleeping. Ugh, it's his mom. At least it isn't Rhonda. Speaking of, maybe you should check and see if there's any pictures of Rhonda. I just have to take a quick peek. No, don't do that. Ugh, no I shouldn't. That's a blunt invasion of privacy. So, I know I said we wouldn't talk, but I missed you so much, and I can't stop staring at those beautiful lips. Great. I'm torn between who to choose. Just friends? Both guys are still not over you, but your mind is preoccupied with the safety of your baby. That is chapter 29. But I will see you lovelies in the next video. If you're liking this, hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell icon because I upload twice a day. And I will see you beauties in the next episode. Bye.